Hello everyone, hope you're doing good. Today we will learn how to reset the computer to factory settings. I'll tell you one of the most easiest and safest way. So let's get started. So in the very bottom left hand side, you just have to type a window. And the moment you type Windows, you will find Windows Update Settings. I'll just click on that. And at the left hand side, you will find Recovery. Now the moment you find Recovery, you will see Reset this PC. If your PC isn't running well, resetting it might help. This will also let you choose to keep your personal files or remove them and then reinstall Windows. So I'll just click on get started and here you get two options. First is keep my files and second is remove everything. So I'll tell you both the things. So I'll go with keep my files. The moment you click on that, it will prepare and it will give you two options how you would like to reinstall windows cloud download or local install so if you select cloud download it will download all the necessary windows 10 files from the cloud and then it will let you install so i'll click on cloud download and i would recommend that as well now this will take uh, probably four to five gigabytes of data so you need to keep that in mind so I'll just select this and current setting restore apps and settings which came with this PC download and reinstall so it will it will restore apps settings which came with this PC if you want to change this setting you can simply click on change and then restore pre-installed apps or download windows so I'll not do anything here I'll just click on confirm and I'll move to the next option plug in your PC so since this computer is not plugged in with the battery I mean charger so you need to plug in that charger and then you just need to click on next it will restart several times and it will install a fresh copy of Windows so I'll move to the next one which is I'll just click on this recovery again and get started and here remove everything when you click remove everything again you just need to select cloud download which will take four gigabytes of data now here remove apps and files do not clean the drive so you can also clean the drive and then download and reinstall windows so here it's do not clean the drive as mentioned so if you want to remove the data and drive and create a new partition then you can simply select yes else you can let it know so I would not make any changes I'll just go with the settings and I'll click on next and uh, make sure the charger is connected to the laptop if it's a laptop and if it's a desktop it will not ask this so once this is done you just have to click on next and follow the online instruction it's very easy and you just need to you know it will automatically restart the computer and if you have any confusion any queries let me know in the comment section I will surely help have and please hit the like and subscribe for more useful videos have a wonderful day